might be wondering what I'm doing dragging this big ass box up to my office. Well, this is an unboxing. I just got the brand new New Air 300H. So once I get this upstairs, I'll dive inside. It's hard to find good help around here. Well, I made it upstairs. It's a big boy. I told you it was big. Package really great. This is it in all her glory. The New Air CC300H. This bad boy holds 400 cigars. 400 stogies. I'm sure sometimes some of us tend to squish in a little bit more when you do boxes and whatnot, just like I did with his younger brother that's sitting right over here. So I'm going to start opening this up so you guys can see. New Air did a real great job of making sure they packed everything nice and tight. Everything was well shipped well as when I opened it up out of there. A lot. They did not spare on the foam and protection, and I'm telling you that. Look at this. And that's the good stuff. They sprung for the real good stuff. Um, let me get here, get some of this tape off. Let me dive right in this bad boy. Get some boxing gold. Soft open up the door. There it is. Little panel. Old panel that's there blocking the glass. Put that off to the side. Oof. There it is. And I'll tell you one thing right off the bat that I just noticed with this model. You don't have that plasticky smell. You might remember when you got the first one, um, but at least when I got mine, I had to go ahead and wipe the whole inside down with some distilled water and a sponge. I did two sessions of it. Worked out great. Took away that plasticky smell. This doesn't have, have it. This does not have it. As soon as you go ahead and stick your nose in here, you can smell this fresh cedar. It smells freaking awesome. Look at the size of these trays. Look at this. Some nice length in there. If you also might notice, they got rid of that little hydrometer. My mine's on mine's was accurate for the most part. I know some people felt like for theirs it wasn't accurate. It was more like a an aesthetic thing. Um, I kind of kind of like that they did did away with it. I think kind of looks good that they did. Kind of got their branding right there. It's another tray here, folks. Now remember, most people want to use this to put both of the packs. Leave distilled water in there? No. This is just strictly when you're going to go ahead and, like I said, when I'm going to wipe these down with the wipes, I use the wipes, the Humi Care wipes for my wiping down of cedar. Or if you have a certain preference that you that might work for you, whether that's filling this up with some distilled water, maybe throwing a couple of Boveda packs in there, this is the cup you would use it. I wouldn't permanently use this. It's just for when you're going to go ahead and season it and you're going to get set up. But it comes with that right there. Go ahead and slide this back in there. Got the next couple of trays that are removable. Back there, you see your fan. Got up here, it's got the light. Down here, another good new feature with this. Man, it's kind of like a cool draft coming out of here, too. Which, that's a good sign. Because this obviously wasn't plugged, and this was shipped, and with, I'm out here in the Midwest, and that means it's real cold right now. We're still in our cold season, and it maintains some nice, cool, cold temperatures in there, so that's not bad at all. Here, I want to show you another cool feature that this model has. You can lock it. Put your key right in there. Lock your stuff away in case you kind of get visitors when you're not home that might come into your stash. My Mandor cave lock is open. Kids come in and out sometimes. You know, I got my brother that might stop by and mess around with my stogies and sends me a picture and says, hey, mind if I take one? Not anymore. Got this bad boy in their lock and key, which on this lower level here, you'll see. There goes your keys right there. With your little guide, which we'll fly through real quick. Like I said, this right here is just going to be a general unboxing. Just want to show you guys what it looks like. There's quite a few videos out there that are going to go in depth on all the technicalities of this machine. But I mean, pretty much the gist of it is this new Air CC300. Basically, what it's going to do for you is it's going to hold your cigars and maintain that temperature. You're always going to always know when. Again, I'm a fan of Boveda. Boveda packs work great for me. I love 69%. It'll maintain that 69% humidity, but then the one thing that we can never account for when we have our standard wooden humidors like I have back there is you can't account for that outside temperature that kind of fluctuates and goes up and down. With New Air, they have it mastered. You set your temperature setting right up here. You go ahead and you can keep that even locked. I love setting it at 69.69. .69 insert a bunch of jokes and comments right there <laughs> that's my percent that I like having humidity humidity excuse me and having my temperature at is at 69 percent both ways this is going to maintain it for you nice and tight and right just like his little brother does over here for me so I can't wait to go ahead and season these trays 
get it all going and fill it up because I'm running out of space back here and it's time for me to fill this thing up and that's why we got this bad boy. So, I mean, New Air's was good so far with the first round with the CC100 and I'm going to give this one a shot and we'll see. Well, there it is, set up, perfectly fine. Wiped out all the Spanish cedar. I'm gonna probably let it sit for the next 24 to 48 hours. Just so you guys can see here, there's some additional instructions that come with this unit. That's your information right there. You've got your little pamphlet that you guys can go through. So your do's and don'ts. Another little nice little breakdown here that they give you guys, breaking down how all this works right here, setting the temperature, turning the light on and off. All that kind of simple good stuff. And this here are the pair of keys that you're gonna use to lock this bad boy up. And they give you two keys. I'm gonna pop it in there, turn. Oop, locked. Oh. As you can see, still haven't fully grasped it. There you go, boom. All set. You're ready to rock and roll. The brand new. New Air CC300H. Following this video, probably about a month or two, I give you guys a little quick recap and let you know how this bad boy's been treating me. I'm sure it's gonna take care of me very nice and well. If you guys like to purchase this unit, I'm gonna put some links right down below to the New Air where you guys can check it out and get yourself this unit. And hopefully you guys make the right choice and you guys do get this unit because it's gonna give you nice and easy peace of mind knowing that you can go ahead and maintain your humidity just right and your temperature. All right, that's it for me, guys. Smoke and E here. I appreciate you guys stopping by. As all the YouTubers say, please make sure you hit subscribe, to click that bell for those notifications when I post new videos, or heck, just hang around my page. I got a hodgepodge of stuff going on here. I'm always trying to, you know, put out my experiences and things that I like and share with you guys. And like, as I always say, I'm not telling you the way to do it, I'm just showing you the way I do it. It might work for you. It might not work for you. But hey, it's all about experiences. All right, you guys. Have yourself a good one. Stop camering me.